bathroom because there's a bathroom on one side, there's food on the other. I, don't, I can't keep you from that. Those are the two primal urges. <laughs> I mean, there's also sex, but <laughs> by the look of this crowd, <laughs> it's not happening. <laughs> quick about it. Uh, one is Walter Murphy, our composer. Uh, Walter, he's an Oscar nominee, he's won a Grammy, he's won an Emmy, and he writes songs for the Ivoryton Playhouse. Uh, uh, Walter was trying to be here tonight, but he's stuck in LA uh, because unlike me, uh, he's got a real job. And, uh, <laughs> so thanks to him, thanks to James Oletti, our amazing director. <laughs> But uh, <laughs> I, wrote, I wrote this play five years ago. No one believed in it except James, and every year he would pay me a dollar for the rights to the play, <laughs> making me one of the highest paid playwrights in America. <laughs> <laughs> but most of all, you guys better uh, give it up for Jackie Hubbard. Yeah. <laughs> and so nobody told her that local theater isn't supposed to be good. <laughs> you know, nobody cares you go to local theater to see your dentist play Phantom of the Opera. <laughs> but she doesn't know that. She puts on all these great shows. Uh, so I hope you appreciate her because she's an immigrant and Trump could kick her out at any moment. <laughs> So let me close with this story. If you've ever seen me before, you've heard me tell this story, but at least this time I've got a prop. And this is really my Emmy. Uh, <laughs> break it, I'm suing. Um, I was born and raised in Bristol, Connecticut. <laughs> are robbing your homes. <laughs> 20 years later, uh, I won my first Emmy for working on The Simpsons, and uh, I told my wife, take a picture, I gotta send it to the hometown paper. This is true. Takes the picture. Four days later, it's on the cover of the Bristol Press. Me, in a tux, holding this Emmy over the caption, Local man claims to win awards. <laughs>